All right, what's up you guys? So I'm gonna give you three factors that influence motivation, okay? So first is failure, the, feel, the fear of failing. The second is lack of support. And the third thing is looking for the right environment or the right time, let's go with the first one. So failure, okay? Most people are afraid to embrace a program because they feel they don't have what it takes to complete the program, or fulfill the requirements of the program, whether it's a exercise program or a nutrition program or a challenge, whatever the case is. So people are afraid of failing. But the reality is no one is perfect, so you have to be okay and embrace the fact that there is gonna, there is gonna be a bumpy road. You're gonna have a good day, you're gonna have a bad day. If you're doing one of those 30-day challenges, you might miss two days, but you can always make those days up by just doubling up or tripling up the work on a different day. So ex you wanna anticipate some bumpy roads. The second thing is lack of support. This is a big one, but if, you're, if your best friend, your spouse, or whatever the case is, your family is not supportive of your health and fitness journey, you're probably not going to succeed. So my advice to those is, is what, you can even use social media as, a, as an avenue to help inspire yourself by looking at the you know, health and fitness um, media influencer to kind of propel you to become more motivated. But look at your current surroundings, and if you find yourself in a like black hole, like negative energy, maybe you kind of have to make some adjustments on that avenue. So kind of surround yourself by more positive or supportive people. Um, that's number two. The third thing is looking for the right time or the, the best setup to work out. And this one's interesting because I've been coaching for 17 years and this popped up the most when people say, people come to me and they say, well, I haven't exercised because I haven't had time or because of blah, 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 blah. But the reality is when you exercise or when you meal prep or whatever it is, it's always gonna be in a non-favorable time for you. So most people who, who look great, who are in shape, who go the extra mile are usually working out during their lunchtime, at home when the kids are asleep, after dinner, early in the morning, whatever it is. You have to understand it's your